What started as a traffic stop for speeding turned into much more. Roswell police confiscating guns and drugs and two people are in jail. Good evening. Thanks so much for joining us tonight for Fox 5 News at 5. I'm Tom Haynes. It's good to be with you. I'm Alex Whitler. Fox 5's Denise Dillon is live in Roswell. And Denise, it sounds like this is not what officers expected to find. Not at all. And please say this is a reminder that there's no such thing as routine traffic stop. The officer said shortly after he stopped that speeding car, he realized he was dealing with much more than just a driver with a lead foot. A Chevy Impala zipping through this 45 mile an hour stretch of Highway 140 caught the attention of a Roswell police officer early Thursday morning. When the officer caught up with the driver at the intersection of Holcomb Bridge and River Exchange Drive, he knew he had to take a closer look at what was in the car. On their initial contact with the driver, they could immediately smell the odor of marijuana coming from the vehicle. The officer reported there was an open bottle of tequila. Upon further inspection, he found a whole lot more. There were six guns that were located inside of the vehicle. One was an AR-15 style rifle and five handguns. And one of those handguns had already been confirmed stolen out of the city of Alpharetta as well. Plenty of guns and a plethora of drugs. So there was a there was a host of drugs that were taken out of the car. There was cocaine, Xanax, um, MDMA, um, some prescription medications as well, marijuana. The driver, 33-year-old Terry Robertson from Decatur and his 23-year-old passenger, Amaya Brown from Jonesboro, were both arrested. The list of charges against them is long. They've been charged with trafficking in, in several narcotics, uh, possession with intent to distribute several narcotics as well. And any time that you have drugs and guns mixing, that is, a, that is a terrible combination. So we're very thankful that those things are now in the hands of our evidence bay and not on the street. Police say this is just another reminder that their officers have to be ready for anything at all times. There is no routine stop and you are always prepared for any eventuality. And both the driver and his passenger are now off the streets and sitting in the Fulton County Jail. Reporting live in Roswell, Denise Stillen, Fox 5 News. All right, Denise, thanks.